God damn, get off me. <laughs> oh, I'm in a cradle position, bro. It's your boy, Poetic Flacco. Anywhere you go, anybody you know, somebody got to know me, and we're back again with another one, folks. Now, check it out. These mumble rappers done hit their final form, bro. They ain't to be playing with no more, man. Like, <laughs> they ain't the same for 2017. They were pups in 2017, right? Uzi started lifting weights, got in the gym, started doing yoga, catastatics. All right, he been doing his thing. Gunna, you know, he's also looking more healthy, right? Listen, these little niggas ain't playing no more, bro. Because if you haven't heard, right, this fan ran up on Gunna at the jewelry store, man. Now, he was on his cloud chasing type time, right? Now, I haven't seen a video from him yet, but you know what's coming, man. Ain't no way he finna get dropped by Gunna and his bodyguard and the video go viral and he don't come online and tell his two fans what happened. I haven't heard him come online and tell us how Gunna was too pussy to give him the one-on-one -on -one and how they jumped him, right? And how he spun back the block and they was gone. I haven't heard that. But what I did see, man, was Gunna in pajamas. Giving us the longest wind-up to a punch ever, bro, right? It's like Gunna was about to punch, but he was coming, he was coming, he was coming, and punch never got there. I'm like, what's going on, bro? Now, what took place again from my particular investigation observations? He ran up on Gunna at the jewelry store, right? You know cloud chasing, right? Just like the little homie did the Uzi, pull out a camera, talking trash, trying to antagonize him. But Gunna had real security, right? Uzi had his girlfriend JT holding him back. Gunna had real security. That security body slammed this boy and put him on his neck. We couldn't show that footage on YouTube, but if you join our Discord, the full video is there. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, bro. This shit kind of satisfying. Seeing the cloud chaser get owned. I'm sick of these cloud chasing ass niggas, yo. I know that one nigga had a problem with Uzi and wanted to fight Uzi because Uzi ain't want to take a picture with him. Think about that, folks. Another man got upset that another grown-ass man did not want to take a picture with him, so he wanted to fight Uzi. Now, I don't know if Gunna is going to get sued because Gunna ain't throw a punch. His security guard did all the work. But I know my limits, right? I ain't no law nigga, right? So I don't know what the repercussions can be if a higher security guard put the pause on another person, right? Can they sue the all this? I don't know, bro. Y'all let me know in the comment section, man. What do you guys think, man? Do you guys think... All right, that this dude deserved the ass whooping, or do you guys think Gunner Num was tripping? It's your boy Portic Flacco. Anywhere you go, anybody you know, somebody got to know me. So please click that like sub and comment, as well as that notification bell, man, and stay for a short message from our sponsor. It's your boy Portic Flacco. I'm out of here, folks. Peace. Crusty could never touch me. Talking about their looks when I'm saying it get ugly. Getting straight to it since they diving in that water. I know they see salty, wishing they never start her. Big mouth niggas go back under your low rocks. You dust blowing niggas would have been in that big house. I'm big cat, no cheese, but trapped in a little mouse. They rolling up their roaches, we're not even a little cough. This real shit, niggas need to focus on their illness. Priorities all fucked up more than a little bit. Little bitch, only thing you smoking is a grill pit. I'm the type to leave a nigga choking on his feelings. The gut guys, but we roll like that throat. Lethal injections to anyone that's high afro. In case I miss the name, I split the block, you know how that goes.